Peace, peace, peace. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another edition of Idi Amin's Talk My Truth, man. Appreciate y'all pulling up again. Listen, by the time you see this, we will have a new president. We will either have Donald Trump as a president again or our first woman president of color at that as the president of the United States of America. Listen, hit the comments. Let me know who y'all voted for. Um, <clears throat> hopefully your candidate won. Let's say they didn't win. At the end of the day, in America, it's all on you. Your destiny is in your hands. Uh, me personally, I did not, I did not vote. Both candidates are, um, for the most part, I'm not a fan of. I, I, I'm not a fan of either candidate per se. Um, some of my political concerns have more to do with. Um, I want the government out our business, especially when it comes to our children. I don't believe a child should have the right to choose what gender they are at such a young age. Um, I don't believe that's a decision that should be left up to a child. If a child can't vote, you know, a child can't buy a gun, um, a child can't, can't, can't work um, past a certain age, why should they be able to choose whether they feel like a male or female? I, I just don't get that, and I never will get that. But to each his own. Um, I believe that decision should be in the in the hands of the parent. And why why does the government even care about that? It doesn't make much sense to me. Um, I live in the state of California. This state historically um, goes blue, goes towards the left side, liberal. So me voting in California either way it's not really gonna make a difference because like I said, traditionally, California goes blue. Anyway, having I've said all of that, like I said, hopefully you got the candidate you won, but at the end of the day, it's all on you. The destiny is in your hands. Your life is in your hands. No political candidate can, um, can change that so long as you believe in you and your capabilities, all right?